Amazon Prime Day is coming up and in many respects will signal the start of the holiday shopping season. Yahoo Finance tech editor Dan Howley is back with us. So, Dan, um, we know that this is going to take place over two days, October 13th and 14th. Jared Blickery's birthday being one of them. <laughs> Are there any deals that they're putting out early uh, this year? Uh, we're not really seeing much yet. Uh, sometimes we do get these early looks at deals. Uh, and then, you know, we see the biggest ones come out uh, as the days progress. And basically, that's just to make sure that people are putting their eyeballs on the site. It's it's a means for them to say, yeah, here's like a little flavor of what we're going to have. But if you really go back and look at the site itself, that's where you'll get exactly what, uh, you know, might be the best deals. But it is interesting to see this happening in October. Obviously, it usually happens during the summer, kind of during the, the doldrums where we don't really have much going on. Uh, and it really helps pick up Amazon. Uh, they said that this has been bigger than Black Friday for them. Uh, it's been one of the biggest shopping days of the year for Amazon. So it'll be interesting to see how it does later on in the year. Dan, one thing I've learned from covering Prime Day the past few years, it's not just Amazon that benefits. The internet essentially gets flooded with new traffic and benefits a lot of other companies too. Yeah, so a lot of the uh, competitors uh, or of Walmart's competitors like to launch their own kind of counter programming to Prime Day. Uh, you'll see something from Walmart, obviously, uh, something from Target as well. And then there'll be smaller you know, retailers that'll be online offering their own kind of take on Prime Day. But, you know, I mean, for the consumer, this is great because it, it pushes competition and competition uh, helps push, put, push prices down and provide better deals. I think for, you know, this year, it's just going to be very different. Uh, you know, a lot of retailers obviously haven't been able to perform exactly well uh, unless they're the larger name brand ones. But I think really it's going to be something that, you know, we'll look at uh, and kind of have to determine if we're going to spend then or spend later in the year for the holidays. This could provide people with good shopping, a good shopping excuse to get everything done ahead of time for the holidays, especially since a lot of people aren't going to be able to get to stores. Uh, they may not want to go to stores when they're packed like that for the holidays. So the online shopping season may be even larger than years past. I mean, do you think that at the end of the day, this this sort of quote unquote holiday for Amazon really is good news for us as the consumer? Because, you know, you have a lot of these retailers pitting, pitting against each other to, to get our dollars. Yeah, I mean, we benefit regardless, right? I mean, Amazon's having this. If you're an Amazon customer, uh, you're a prime customer, you pay the 119 a year, you're getting the benefits of, you know, they say a million uh, sale goods, goods on sale, uh, as well as obviously the other benefits of prime, the uh, faster delivery and the prime video services, things like that. Uh, but then those competing companies and their sales are also going to really help out consumers. We don't lose on this. Uh, it's more just uh, along the lines of how these companies can try to win us over even more. And, you know, look, Prime Day originally started out kind of blah. You know, they, they had things like toilet paper and toothpaste on sale. And everyone was like, well, you, you advertise this massive day for toothpaste and toilet paper. Uh, but then they've become uh, it's become more of a, a real shopping event where you'll see things like big ticket items, TVs, uh, video games, uh, basically everything that I want uh, is going to be on sale. And so I think it's, it's become a, a greater event than uh, it probably uh, even Amazon thought it would be. Hey investors, Zach Guzman here. Are you interested in learning more about the markets and getting the latest financial news? Well then click right here to subscribe to our Yahoo Finance YouTube channel. Get the latest up to the minute market analysis, big interviews in the world of finance and information on how to manage your money every day wherever you are.